Hey there guys, welcome back to the SD Gaming Channel, it's Sakif here and we've actually got a new indie game that's been gifted to us by the company called Kurzaven. Obviously the game is called, uh, let me just get it for you, The Circle of Kurzaven. So we are just going to be playing this and I'm going to give you guys, it's a demo, so the, the public demo goes live, I think it's tomorrow now, in UK time. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to give you the demo today, so I hope you guys enjoy it. Uh, yeah, here we go. Ah, good that you are here. You've probably already heard, we want to develop the huge Kurzavan region. I know this may surprise some, especially since our territory holds only a small population and thus hardly any taxes, and especially that region is almost desired. You must see the situation of the entire empire. In the north and south of the empire, we are seeing rapid population growth. Already now it becomes more and more difficult for the common people. Farms are being cut up smaller and smaller by real division, while taxes remain the same or even increase. New land can only be gained to a limited extent by clearing or by developing less optimal areas. Even among the nobility, there are more and more descendants who are not entitled to inherit. I think, to, I think you see where I'm going with this. We may be one of the large countries in the empire, yet we are insignificant, but it does, doesn't have to be that way. I want you to develop the Kurzavan region, be wise and make sure that the people lack nothing. New settlers will come to you from different regions of the empire, bringing with them different customs and ideas. Treat them with openness and decency, so that they prefer to live with you rather than elsewhere. Your first goal will be to build a community centre to consolidate your position in the region. For this, you will need a lot of wood, stone and other materials. Take care of your supplies as well, because the summer is quickly over. Good luck, we are counting on you. Alright, cool. Got the gist of the situation. Uh, oh, all right. So it's top-down view. That's oh, I love the graphics. The graphics is nice. Cartoony design. All right, so we can select the people. Uh, they even got their own randomly generated names, which is cool. Uh, let's see. So let me start the building tab. All right. Okay, let's do a gatherer shack. <laughs> I think that's the easiest thing. Let's start gathering resources. Um. Hmm. Okay, so it's pretty simple. Just click and drag and press the R key to like rotate it. It looks like there's uh, places that you can't put it, obviously, with the X. Uh, let's put it this way. There we go. Uh, forest of stump. I'm going to put the stump. you got to put it here, I think. Alright, let's put it there. What's this? Primitive stonery. Not sure where to put it. Uh, da, 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 da. I've not got a fishing place, but yeah, let, let's look. I think I'm gonna do a straw heart first. Yeah, let's do a straw heart. Put that there. Do another one. There we go. Looks like they're starting to build it. So far, so good, I must say. Um, yeah. Let's see what's going on around here. So it's it's quite a large world, which is really cool. So obviously that's the edge of the borders. We've got the map here on the bottom right. The HUD is pretty informative. It's got a lot of information. We've got drinks. We've got fodder. Don't know what fodder is. Food, obviously. Mega jewels. Materials, equipment, various, and wealth. And what's this? This is uh, obviously a time scale, so we can speed up the time. And, and slow it down as well. Uh, looks like we're coming. Oh, what's this? I think this is summer. Oh yeah, yeah, we're coming into spring, summer, autumn, and winter. So it's got the four seasons. We've got mail, new settlement. There we go. Da, 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 da. Yeah, it's reading that. The journey begins. All right, so let's come back to that later. Uh, it looks like they're done building the forest stump and the gatherer shack. Uh, just a straw hat. A straw, a straw hat. Sorry, I'm thinking about Luffy from One Piece now. Uh, the straw hat. Let's have a look at that. I'm just going to quickly turn down the sound. Uh, da, 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 da. There we go. Much better. Yeah. Uh, might have been a bit too loud for the start, but that's alright. Uh, it sounds good to me. Uh, da, 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 da. I'm just waiting for them to build the straw hut. And I've got two that I need to build. Hmm. Maybe if I build uh, more paths. I wonder how I can build paths. Let's see. Get rid of this. Get rid of this. Get rid of this. Uh, do, 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 do. There's whiz. What's that? 
A stepped where to completely impound the water during dry. Okay, that's not a path. Fences, gates, stone fence, wooden torch, high lantern, small lantern, packages. Okay, what's this? I think you can plant stuff. Wheat fields, cactuses. Yeah, cool. That's pretty cool. Uh, da, 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 da. Anyway, there's the mud street. Mud street. That's what we needed. All right, cool. Um, I'm going to... There we go. Connect it there. Connect it here. Let's bring it all the way. What I'll do is I'll put it there. Connect it there. Connect it there. There we go. So that way, so that they can move around a little more, a bit, a bit more quicker. All right. So that quest has been completed. So the next one that we're going to be doing, uh, let's see, primitive stone masonry, hard milk. Is that Quern? I don't know how to say that. Baker's simple oven, firewood, and a fireplace. I guess we've got the fireplace here, so I'm going to pop down the fireplace. You know what? I'm going to pop that here. I'll rotate it. That way, it's next to camp. What else we got? we got the Baker's simple oven. Uh, I'm going to put that next to the campfire, obviously, because, you know, put fire where fire is, right? Do, 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 do. Uh, is that the handmill? Yeah, there we go. The handmill Quern. I'll pop that here as well. You know, you just be sensible. I want to keep everything close. So it actually feels like, you know, it's, um, I don't know how to say it now. <laughs> it's close together, basically. There you go, primitive stonery. I'll put that over here, actually. I'll try and pop that here so it makes sense to go with the wood stuff. Stone, wood up there. A lot of hard materials over here. Cooking stuff and fireplaces over here. Huts maybe around here. We'll expand the huts, I guess. I'll, put the, I'll, I'll expand more huts here. Sounds like a plan. But yeah, it's, it's, it's pretty... I love the design, man. It's really simple, yet elegant. Um, it's stunningly beautiful. I love it. It's, it's so refreshing to see a design like this. Um, usually you just see people like like caring too much of the details, but this is really nice. I, re I love it. I love it. There we go. There's our little camp from from a bird's eye view so yeah I think yeah definitely like I'm gonna expand this way plan to anyway so these areas here uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do here yet but we'll, we'll have a look at that later down the line so you got animals moving around so what's this that's a grey wolf okay so they got wolves they got sheep they got foxes sheep yeah they got quite a lot um, I guess one thing that I want to try is maybe maybe if you can build a farm. I don't know if you can build a farm. I mean, this is the first time I'm playing this game, so, <laughs> you know, let's see if we can try it. Uh, is it Stonemation Shop? Smelter. Oh, yeah, there is a farm. Here we go. Simple barn. So, yeah, you can actually have, like, a proper farm. So, we'll have a look and see how far that is. So, we've got wild wheat over here. Grass grass more wheat over here and um, what is this what's this fruit tree oh look that tree completely went damn so it looks like the trees they get taken down material place what's this uh, can we collect these stored goods uh, okay so that's what we have I think that's like our starting stuff uh, so I'm gonna have to like put more what you call it uh, cutting areas that's it Forest stumps, is it? Forest stumps, yeah. A quarry. Actually, no, maybe. I think that's a quarry. Oh, and those are stones. Okay, cool. How are we going to get up there? That's the question. Uh, there seems to be some sort of... Yeah, there are paths. It's going to be a long haul of a build, though. That's, that's the problem there. Do, do, do. Is there one maybe here that's quicker? No. No, nothing on the right side. So up there, that's where the quarry is. Oh, what's this? Stones. There's a few stones there. Alright. Uh, you know what? I'm going to do it properly over here. There we go. Look, there's 315 stone. That's a lot of stone. Alright, let's build it there. Uh, the, the, the primitive stone masonry. Pop it here. Someone should go over there and get that. Or build it. What else can I build in the meantime? 
We've got the fireplace running, which is nice. A sawing place. Where can I put that? Let's actually see what he does first. Build a small place to process wood by chopping and sawing the raw wood is processed in planks or firewood. Got you, got you. I guess I'll put the saw, saw stuff here, maybe? Oh yeah, I'll pop it here. Let's do it here. Behind there. That way. Makes a lot of sense. Let's check out these tabs. So, it looks like this is faction data, map, deconstruct targets, so like side objects, remove modifications, and then mud tree. So, there's a quick tab there. That's pretty cool. Because then, we're literally hitting into spring soon. Uh, first year as well. So, we're doing, we're doing quite well, actually. Doing really, really well. Uh, I'm trying to see what else I can do at the minute. Gather a shack, got that. Forest stump, we need to build one of those. I need to put that there. There you go. Oh, did I just take out a whole tree? Hopefully that didn't destroy the tree. I think I did. I think I did. It's too late for that. Oh, well. It is what it is. So, let me guess. The Oh, yeah, they actually are traveling that whole way. Alright, cool. I'm gonna I'm gonna make a path. Let's make a path so it's quicker. Thankfully, the path doesn't actually cost anything. I think I say that. Watch how like, all my resources are just gone. It does help them move quicker. Which way is quicker there, though? Let's see which way they want to take. Do they want to go around? I mean, I can build the path around. Okay, so it looks like they are going this way. So, which... Let's watch. Okay, I'll just follow this guy and make the path quicker. Oh, there we go. I see the path now. Hey, connected it. Connect the dots. There we go. Paths all completed. They can get up there now. I think you can also design the landscape as well in this game. So I'm going to give that a try. See how that goes. A confia. Plants a new confia. No, oh, where's the base? I think I'll plant stuff like that there. Fruit trees, broad leaves, yeah, broad leaves, let's do some of that. I don't know if it's gonna take it all the resources or not. We'll see. There you go. Fruit trees, yeah, let's do some fruit trees. Bush, cactus, wheat field. Garden bit. Let's do wheat fields. Let's do. I'm gonna do wheat fields here. So let's match it there. Set up a lot of these things. I think what I'm gonna do is time to build a bit, a few more huts. So, like I said, I'll put them here. There we go. More projects, so more people can live in the huts. These guys are dropping off resources which is good how many resources left uh, delivered material pending material so just three more pieces of wood that's it just gotta wait for that it's pretty interesting I really do love it I think like they walk slow on the grass I'm so making a pavement for them it works so much better really really happy that like this game is like you know like really happy to play this game honestly it's beautiful it's a, <laughs> it's just aesthetically pleasing it's so nice to look at in the eye and it's a city builder simulator that's what i love you know i mean like looking after nature growing with the growing the civilization around it that's it's really cool All right so it looks like they are digging into some of the resources over there the gatherer shack uh Okay. 
get fruits, get vegetables, harvest roots, and sprouts. Got grass and grain in there, so that's good. Okay, let's have a look. I'm gonna try and find the um, how our people are doing. So let's see. So happiness is here. I think ha I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm happy. So it looks like they're all happy. That's good to know. I like keeping my people happy. Storage, census, red deer. What does that mean? Does that mean that there's so many of them? Oh, days. Storage. That's what we have in storage. Schedule. Population. Okay. So we've got a lot of things in construction. Oh, what's this? What's this mean? There's a raccoon. Uh, what the hell? How do I get rid of the raccoon? Uh, da 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 da. Follow target. How do we get rid of the raccoons? I don't understand. Uh, I might need to figure that out. We've got raccoons stealing our stuff right now, which is brilliant. Um, a lot, absolutely love that. Okay, so I think it's... Is this pending anymore? Okay, so we've got a worker called Dominic moving off to that location to try and work on it. We've still got people going with wood, so... I'm not sure what exactly is going on. I think I'm going to try and speed it up, see how it's going. There we go. There it goes, built up. Wow, that is seriously fast speed, that is. Look at that. Okay, let's slow, let's slow it down. Uh, let's have a look and see what how people are doing. Wow, they really are happy. Um, some light protection from the weather. I need at least some clothes to withstand the cold and hot climate. Okay, cool. So it looks like they've got some more needs now. Primitive stone memory series working. The hand milk one, baker's simple oven, and the firewood should be built soon. Um, <clears throat> we need to give people homes. We need to build more homes. Okay, so let's build a few more huts. There you go, that should be good. So we set up plans for like more hearts. We planted a lot of trees actually, so they they'll, they'll grow hopefully. Wheat fields here, it'll grow. I'm gonna speed up a little bit. Okay, maybe not a little bit. Let's go a lot. Let's speed this up. I'm gonna go max. I don't know if I can select it. Employees, someone employed to it. Jin's employed to it. Okay, that's cool. All right, Jin, you do you, bro. Get to work on it whenever you can. We've got, whoa, wheat fields. That, that is a thick wheat field, you know? I'm actually going to build some more. Let's do it. Where is it going? There it is. Turn that, turn that to wheat, turn that to wheat, turn that to wheat. Uh, da, 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 da. Oh, we've got Hunter's Heart, Simple Barn, Well. Oh, yeah, well, there we go. Wait, where do we need to put the well? Uh, da, 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 da. From the ground. Okay, cool. I'll put the well right here. Literally put it right here. Yeah, put it there. And a simple barn. I'll put that in the farming area. So that could be... Yeah, I'll pop it here. There you go. There you go. We'll pop it there. Pop it there. I'll build a road. I'll build a road for it. I will. Oh, no, I can't build a road. It's gone too far out. That's right. There we go. What else can I build? Ooh, open dairy production. We can even build a community center. A tap room, small cabin, cesspit. Pit for all the dirt. Okay, cool. Alright, I'll put the cesspit. I'm gonna put the cesspit right here in the corner. There's there's nothing here in this corner, right? Yeah. Here we go. Cesspit there. Do 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 do. So we can do stone fences, but I think right now. I think I'm just going to build a higher wooden fence. 
Don't know exactly where. Oh, no, maybe, maybe we should build a gate here. Nope, no, no, no! It's the wrong way, wrong way. Here we go. So, gate. So, I selected the gate, rotate it. There we go. Build a gate at the bridges. Put a gate here. Put a gate here. There we go. That way, things won't come in, I think. Hopefully. <laughs> I haven't built any fences, but we'll try. I want to speed up time again. I need to see how far this can go. Let's see if everything gets built up. There you go. Things are coming. Things are happening. They're collecting wheat. What's going on here? Okay, let's slow it down again. Alright, so we've actually got more huts and everything. Okay, that's pausing it. Natasha, what does she need? Not enough storage space, no problem. Upgrade available. We need flour. Oh yeah, we need the well, that's what we need. The well. Alright, so let's fast forward until they build the well. There we go, well's been built. Oh yes, grain's being uh, milling. It's being milled. Nice! This is awesome. Well happy with this. Hut's been built. Not all huts, this one still needs to be built. The barn needs to be built here. But yeah, in due time it's doing good. I think we've done a really great start to this. Honestly, like the, the little village that we've built up, set up, it looks like it's running smoothly. We've got places to, you know, we've got people, yeah, well, we've got places to live for people, like houses. There you go, they're all happy. Seems to be happy right there. Um, they've all got food, water. We've got a cesspit over there that needs to be built, but eventually soon. Hunter's cabin, a barn to come through. So, yeah, I'm hoping, like, you know, if, <laughs> if, if, if this does well, we'll be doing a second episode. Carrying on with the demo and seeing how far we can actually advance. Yeah, well, honestly, guys, if you guys like this video, please thumbs up the video. Honestly, give give Curse of N, uh, a re a good look. Add it to your wish list. It's, it's an amazing game. Honestly, in my opinion, I recommend it. It is beautiful. It's stunning. Um, the gameplay is smooth. It's nice. <laughs> I'm having a lot of fun, honestly, just watching the citizens grow. And I think that, the, that watching them, especially like in fast mode, that's really cool, too. Uh, I can't wait to see how far this game develops. Um, I will be following this uh, regularly. So yeah, uh, you guys want to see another episode? Hit that like button, put it in the comments, let us know. And we'll hopefully we'll get back to it. Cheers, guys.